Hello everyone, welcome back to my summer car. My name is Jeff Aviano, and we're gonna continue our game here. Let's head to the sauna, because our dirtiness is off the charts, as usual. And this is still running, so that's good at least. Uh, although I think we do need some more water. Yes, we do. We need some water. Oh, that's why I always leave the damn door open, because I always... Always have the water bucket and forget about it. That's what happens every time. But you always got to close that sauna door so you don't lose all your stuff. All right, there we go. Fill this piece of shit up. Fill up the water bucket. And today we are going to pretty much put focus on the engine. We need to work on that engine and get it close to done. So down you go. Oh, I did it again. I did it again. There we go. Let's pick you up. We're getting faster at this ever so slightly here. Yeah, just like sit you right there. Whoop. Come on, close the door. What are we at? Oh yeah, the decameter decometer. We'll call it that. The decometer is off the charts, so that's good. It's ready to go. And I get a lot of people telling me how to actually play this game, and I'm like, you know what? Like it, it, and it's very, very, very funny to me because it's always something like, Oh, you gotta do this. It's like, yeah, we've done that before, man. I I, I know how it works. Uh, but also it's like basic life things. Like, if you drink juice, it'll do this. I'm like, yeah, I know. Maybe I don't want to do that, you know? You ever think of that? And I know you can piss into the sauna and it does the same thing, but hey. Oh, we're just going to keep peeing. Well, we're just going to piss on the floor in here. That's what we're just going to do. He's just got his dick out. He's going to piss everywhere. He doesn't care. He don't care none. Yeah, keep pissing, dude. And not enough. Not enough urine to, uh, to bathe ourselves, that's for sure. And you know what? We're just going to like be a total fire hazard and just leave this damn thing on until it runs off. Just in case we need it later. You never know. Never know when you're going to need it. Let's close our doors because, you know, it drives me nuts to not do that. All right. What we got in the fridge here? We got, oh, we got beer. We got pizzas. Let's, let's have a pizza today. Let's have a pizza for lunch. Close it. All right. We'll eat you. We will eat your. There we go. Hunger is down. Urine's up. Fatigue is up th off the charts as usual. So we're going to take a, a nap. And then when we wake up, we're going to throw some uh, of that mosquito repellent on. I have that unplugged for a reason. And we're going to work on the engine. Let's do it. Time to get the day started. We're excited. We're going to be working on our stuff. Turn that on. Did that really turn that light on? That looked like it did. The hell does that even go to? Is it the one out there? I think it is. It just looks weird. That's all. Hey, we do have a clock right there. Look at that. All right. Let's turn on our garage lights. You can hear that damn sauna. I almost might turn that off just so it doesn't drive us absolutely crazy here. All right. There we go. All right. Amazing. All right. I don't remember where we left off. I think we got this. Yeah, we got the crankshaft in there. We've got... Uh, we put the bearings in. We did the oh pistons. We did the pistons last time. Camshaft is next. Let's uh, rotate this guy this way. Yeah, bam, just like that. Yeah, that'll work for now. So we need the camshaft, which I believe is that's a rocker shaft. That's on the top. There's a camshaft right there. Take the camshaft. Woo! And this guy's got to go in here somewhere. Got to find out where it's gonna be happy. Yep, goes right in there, just like that. And I think we're going to have to work on it the other way. Uh, so I can actually see what we're doing. Let's see if we can find those damn bolts. Let's uh, pick up a spanner and just see if we can find them. And it might be on the front, I would imagine. The hell does the camshaft attach? I don't know very much about an inline four like this, like I have said in the past. Is it tiny? It is tiny. It's tiny Tim. It's a little tiny Tim here. Oh, it's starting to pour down rain outside. Shit. I'm glad we're in here. Rainy day. Working on the engine. Working on the engine in a rainy day. All right. That's cool. Awesome. Done with that. Back to normal mode. What do we have next? We've got the crankshaft. We did that. Our camshaft. I mean, uh, there should be gear that goes to the camshaft on the front, right? Camshaft gear. Yep. Camshaft gear. Uh, I think it goes on. Yeah. On the front. Beautiful. All right. Let's see. Oh, drop that tool mode, please. Oh, is it the correct spanner? Of course not. Of course not. It might be up size. Nope, not you. You. Nope. It's going to be a bigger one. Uh, bigger than that, actually. 
a pretty good sized bolt on it so yeah there it is right there i love how it still gives you the no smoking sign it's like nope that's not the correct bolt you dumbass so now we do the timing stuff timing chain there should be a timing chain and a cover timing chain and that's the clutch we have a timing cover cover somewhere but i i know we gotta put the timing chain on it oh time and chain time and chain oh had a little uh little check mark there we go beautiful do we have a bolt on that i'm sure we don't i think that's how it goes but we need the timing chain cover right there's a cover that goes over it what does that look like wait if you were a timing chain cover where would you hide yourself well it's around here somewhere oh timing cover found you found you found you uh yeah oh yeah i saw the check mark Oh, let be the trick. Be the check mark. Be the check mark. Aha! We got a bunch of fucking bolts here. Great. I think that's all these bolts. That's all the bolts we need for that guy. All right. Cool. Well, you, you, we learn. We learn. We learn. All right. Water pump time. Yeah, y'all. And the water pump looks like these. There's the water pump. Get the doggy. All right, if you were a spanner, what would you be? Well, I'm gonna go with uh, what we had before. Nope, might be something a little smaller. Let's try a one on that guy. Nope, it's gonna be the two. Is it really gonna be a two? Uh, or a three? Yep, it's a three. There we go. All right, cool. Done with that one. Now what we need, we need, uh, if we got a water pump on there, we're gonna need a pump something pulley or something like that there it is the pulley system that goes on the front so we can attach that little belt on there later on Whoop. get on there you shun bitch oh right there it is picking up something else in there it's picking that up i think we did something wrong because it is picking that that bolt up for some reason and not that oh no it does still pick up the other ones i don't know man i think we need to do a starter hmm or do we, do we put the plate on then the starter? I don't know. This is, that doesn't seem right, does it? No, it does not. Let's, uh, let's pick it up from a different way. Well, let's try turning this thing around. Down you go there. Maybe it goes on the back. That seems a little bit more like it, but I could be wrong. Oh, it is the back, damn it. Aha, yes. That looks like a starter there with the solenoid. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where do you go? Oh, shit, yeah, right there. Fantastic. And it looks like it's a couple bolts. Yep, just two bolts right there. Let's uh, go into tool mode. Are you these? No, you're not those. Okay, are you this guy? Mm, yep, you are. Go in that way, into the plate. Beautiful. I think it's just two bolts on a starter into the plate yeah i don't see anything else yep just those two beautiful all right so the starter we need a flywheel because we need to start working on the clutch and all that and that's on the back side so that would make sense uh we have a flywheel that looks like a what the hell is the flywheel oh here it is duh you can definitely tell that oh shit working on the transmission end here of the engine no, you don't. Oh, there it was. Okay. I thought it was this area. Just dealing with the, you know, the game being, being game gun a game. Flywheel's done. Uh, we're time. We're, okay. So transmission on the back clutch is next. We do the clutch where it would, if you were a clutch, where would you be? You'd be right there. There's the disc of the clutch, Whoop. which is going to go kind of like sort of in this area, right? If you were a clutch where would you go this is the disc it's not the actual clutch maybe clutch master cylinder is that what we need first the clutch master cylinder we need a clutch master cylinder here this ain't making no damn no sense here to me all right that's the master cylinder that probably goes into the fucking actual engine okay i th we have to build the damn clutch that's what we have to do so that only makes sense Oh, there was the little check mark. Yeah, that goes there. And then the damn clutch is going to go on. The, the disc is going to go on it. There are three parts to the clutch there. I was like, um, okay, what does that do? And yeah, right there. Damn you, damn you. Now it makes sense. Let's put this on the flywheel and make everybody happy now. Oh, 
there it is. It's a beautiful thing. And let's see here. We got one, two, three, four. Let's try. What do we got? Oh, put her in tool mode. Uh, eight. What do we got here? We got any six. Let's try a six first. Oh, yeah. These look like little smaller ones. So we're going to do that. All right. Very cool. Now we're done with that. That we can say hallelujah to. And we need to move. Uh, we need to put the. Maybe we're ready for the oil pan. On the bottom of the engine. Right there. Yep. There there she is. There's the oil pan. Uh, where does it go? Is it down there? Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. It's right there. This is going to be rusty bucket galore. All right. Yeah. In you go. It's coming along, folks. It's coming along. Okay. Oil pan. Are we ready for the gearbox already? I mean, we have the engine pretty much upside down right now. I can try to flip it around here. Let's uh, pick it up. Block is up. Lay it on its side. Boom. Uh, gearbox. Where do you attach to? I know you're next. You've got to be close to being next. Let me be like this. Might be like, oh, I saw it. Oh, I see it. Yes. And gearbox, what do you need? Oh, I don't even know what those are going to be. Not, oh, shit. Same one as last time. Sevens. Very cool. I love it whenever a plan comes together. All right, we have one there. We have one here. Yep, that looks good. And you go inside that hole. And wow, lots. Lots of bolts today. How about that? Well, while we're working here, we can talk about a little bit of things. I see a flood of people talking about uh, YouTube um, and its new algorithms and all that good stuff. I haven't been affected by it, or I don't think I have at least. It hasn't been a, a worry for me. Um, but don't worry. I won't be like clickbaiting or anything like that. I've never done that before and I won't start now. I don't think that that's the answer. I, I don't think people are like, well, we have to just play the game. Well, I mean, I understand maybe you feel that way, but I don't feel like you have to play the game. I think that, you know, maybe people are just getting tired of certain shit and they're just like, no, we don't want to watch this no more. Okay. I think that we got all those bolts. I could be wrong, but I think we did. That's looking pretty good. It's starting to look like an engine to me. I think we can flip it over now because we have to start working on the top of it. So let's grab the, not the gearbox, actual block here. Yep. Up you go. And we're going to rotate it. Rotator. Um, about like this. Yeah, like that. Because we had to start working on the top of this thing. Uh, although we didn't put the drive gear in it, did we? Shit. Drive gear. There you are. And when, where do you go at? Are you in the front somewhere? No, you are not. You're in the back, aren't you? You're probably in the back, aren't you? Where the hell does the drive gear go on a freaking inline four? That's a good question, but I would imagine it would be on the other side, wouldn't it? Let's see. Yup. Yup. That makes sense. That would, that would make sense. Okay, cool. I think now we can start working on the top of the engine. I think we're at that point now. Okay. With well, the inline four, you got that, 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 uh, I say we start working on the top, top here. And won't we need a head gasket first? Cause this is the th first thing. Like if you, you know, you're, you, you, they're like, I, I cracked a head on my car. They're like, Oh shit. That sucks. It's like, oh, the head gasket's got to be redone. Well, you got to just take off the rockers and all that, but it's it's a little harder than that. Uh, cylinder head. I thought the rocker shaft goes in. Oh, cylinder head. Duh. Yeah, the rocker sits on top of the cylinder head. Yeah. Yep, that's where that goes. Because the uh, for a second there, I was like, oh, we didn't bolt anything. Not it's a damn head gasket. Duh. But this will require bolts. Absolutely. No, it won't be you. And you're not going to be a five, are you? Nope. You're going to be the little bitch. For those of you that uh, follow me on Snapchat, you'll notice uh, I uh, started, I put up a few uh, videos last night. We uh, put up this Santa ski slope thing. It's like seriously from the, it's either late seventies or eighties or something. Been in my mom's attic forever. My uncle owned it before. Uh, and these little things go up the ski slope around the Christmas tree and they ride around the Christmas tree, They're like little magnetic, like ski people. I don't know. It's hard to explain, but if you're on my Snapchat and it's a uh, Jay Fabiano, my Snapchat, and you were like, uh, don't know what the hell I'm looking at here, Jeff. That's what it was. That's what it was. All right. Rocker shaft time. That goes on top. Oop, I think. Yep. 
All right. And what do you take, sir? Would you take the same one? Of course not. All right. It's, it looks bigger than that. So let's try. Oh, yeah. Uh, got lucky on that one. I love how they were pretty generous with the, uh, but like um the amount of bolts. I'm glad they weren't like, oh, here's like real life thousand bolts in one spot. You'd sit here forever doing with this mouse wheel stuff. So thank you to the gaming developers for that. Hey, look at this. It's actually starting to look like an engine. I'm pretty proud of that. Pretty proud. Okay, so I think we can put the rocker cover on it now. If we just we just did the rocker shaft. Yeah, we can put the rocker cover on it. Man, this is actually starting to work. I am quite surprised. All right. And of course, you take bolts. Yes, you do. Not the same ones. It looks smaller. Only smaller. Ertl makes them just like the real thing. Only smaller. Got lucky there. I'm starting to get this uh, spanner business down. It's taking a little bit to get used to, but hey, I am getting it down. In you go. I think we could put a, the headers on. I think this only has one header for a single pipe exhaust. Where were you just a minute ago? There it is. Headers go here. Headers go here. Where did they go at? On the side over here? They go on the side of something. They got to produce that exhaust. Where that? Oh, of course. It, it's in a very, very strange spot. Ah, uh, air filter. Where are you? Oh, shit. It's sitting on here. I'm an idiot. It's like right here on top of the damn workbench. I think it's there. Or maybe where the hand is. Maybe that's where they want it. Just like put it on. The, oh. Yep. And I think you hand screw it. Or you just set it there. I don't know. No tool mode. You don't. Yeah. I don't think it needs any. What? Oh, we already did that one. Okay. Yeah. It doesn't need anything. So it just sits on top there and you, you know, obviously put it on there. I, I, I don't know. That's very strange to me, but the carburetor should go on, right? Where the hell's a carburetor going to go on this guy on an inline four? I don't know where the hell a carburetor goes. I really don't. It's good. Oh, goes there and then the air filter on top of it. <laughs> Son of a bitch. That makes sense. That makes sense. I was like, it's not attaching to anything. I'm like, it goes on top of the damn carburetor, you dumbass. I think now we can put the damn air filter on. It was a, that was a bonehead move. I'm like, I've worked on so many carbureted engines. I should know that. Duh. And can we hand tighten air filter? Probably not. It has a little hand symbol. And I was like, oh, that's for the damn oil thing. That makes more sense. So we're going to move this block over this way so we can see a little bit better. And let's put these sparky plugs in. All right. Spark plug one. You go in there. Don't you go in here? Don't you go in here somewhere? You bastard son of a bitch. I guess each one goes to a certain spot or you have to start on the left side first. That is just so strange. And you have to get a certain angle on this damn thing uh, in order for him to take. So I think that each one has its own slot. Yes, it does. That was driving me crazy. I was like, how the hell? Why would it matter that much? But apparently to this game, it matters. It does. So fantastic on them. All right. We got the damn spark plugs in. Can we tighten these? Uh, I think we hand tighten these. Uh, yeah, you hand tighten them. Beautiful. Let's put these guys in. I was like, what the hell is happening here with these spark plugs? It, I, I try every angle known to man, and it turns out that they're all in different spots. Son of a bitch. All right. So next is the fuel pump. If you were a fuel pump, where would you be? I don't know what it looks like on this car. That's the clutch master cylinder. And uh, do, 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 do. fuel pump. Found it. Found it. Does it go on this side? Where does it go? Fuck. Yeah. Beautiful. I had no idea, but apparently that's where it goes. And it looks like it has a bolt or two. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. Not a bolt there. And it comes down to there. Uh, there they are. There are these little things here. Is it the right one? Really? Holy crap. I had the right spanner in my hand. I love it when, when a plan works out like that. That's cool. All right. We have another one. Yep. There it is. 
I think those are the only two. Because that'll... Nope, that's those guys. From earlier. Okay, so... Yeah, so that brings the fuel up. And around. And it goes into the carburetor there. And dumps it right on in there. That's just what it does. Okay, cool. So, fantastic. Uh, fuel pump's done. Now we can do the distributor. We have oil filter too. Oh, we didn't put the oil filter on? Shit. That should have gone after the carburetor. I don't think it matters. Where the hell does the oil filter go on this car? I oh, 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 I saw, oh, oh, oh. Right there. Yeah, right there. And do you take a bolt? I'm sure you do. It wouldn't even make sense if you didn't. I think it just pops on there, it looks like. They don't really show you much here, do they? They like to give you the no smoking symbol, but that's about it. I'm just going to assume that pops on there, the oil filter. They don't want us to bolt anything down, but that's something we can always go back to. All right. We did the fuel pump. Now we can do the distributor. That makes more sense now. Distributor. Oh, oh, oh. Right in that hole there. And what are you going to take? You're going to take something here. I have a feeling. I have a feeling. Yes. Found the bolt. I love when I find the bolt. It's just one bolt, really, for a distributor. Not bad. Cool. Uh, fantastic. All right. And I think we have the yep, engine electronics need to go on this thing. Wherever the, the spark plugs will go. That's what the blue ones are for. Is it just going to give us like a general area or not going to happen? It's not going to be happy with us, is it? I'm just going to, I'm looking for the check mark. That's all we're looking for here. The check mark of approval. I don't think they like that. We're going to have to pick it up from a different way. Pick it up from a different way. Uh, let's try that. Nope. Don't like that, do you? All right, let's try that. This makes more sense than it did before. It's still not giving me a check mark though. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. And that bolts into the actual car. Holy crap. We did it. We, we did it. That makes sense. That bolts into the car and then this comes off of here and that ignites the spark plugs and then go to the distributor. Okay. Fantastic. Wow. We're done for the most part. We have hubcap, blah, 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 blah. We've got the master cylinder that goes in the actual car and brake lining and all that. Hunger. We're going to die. We're going to die. Holy crap. I don't know how I missed that, but all right, we're going to get, uh, get some food. But guys, that's going to do it for this episode. It was uh, just basically boring working on an engine. I understand that, but we will continue. We'll do some more jobs. We need to make some more money, actually. Uh, eat that, dude, so we don't die. Oh, dying of thirst. If you're dying of thirst, have some water. I always say. Um, But yeah, that's uh, going to do it. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. Thank <laughs> you.